while this thing's getting going. Uh, what you should do right now, if you guys are watching this, get a pen, get some paper, get ready to take some really awesome notes because we're going to try to provide for you as much value as possible tonight. Again, we're going to provide for you as much value as humanly possible. So that is that. So if you are brand new and you're watching this for the very first time, we want to officially welcome you to our conference room, the Now Lifestyle Conference Room, uh, here with myself, uh, Daniel Kump. I'm one of the top leaders with Now Lifestyle. Every single, um, every single Tuesday night at nine o'clock Eastern Standard Time, we're going to bring you guys value. I'm going to be interviewing leaders, people that are taking massive, massive, massive action and getting some absolutely amazing results. And we're going to interview them. I'm going to ask them point blank questions. What are you doing in your business? How are you getting great results? You guys are going to be able to learn from these people. And you can get this every single Tuesday, guys. We're going to bring you value every single Tuesday, just like we do with the rest of Now Lifestyle on Wednesday with Richard and John and on Thursday with Janet. And coming soon to a theater near you guys, there's going to be a very uh, new webinar starting too, um, most likely on Monday nights, guys. So stay tuned for that. And uh, we're going to have some super awesome people uh, doing a new uh, Monday webinar, most likely. So uh, stay tuned for even more value uh, with Now Lifestyle. Super, super awesome. So uh, without further ado, uh, what I want to do right now is uh, in a minute here, we're going to bring on our guest for this evening. So <clears throat> I had the, um, it was crazy. I actually worked with, like not directly, but I worked with um, the woman that we're going to bring up here in, in just a minute in another company. And I didn't even realize it. it was crazy because obviously different leaders, different legs, all that other stuff. But, uh, she was a rock star in that company. That company had some unfortunate stuff going on and they got shut down by the FTC, which really, really sucks. We all hate when that happens. Cause you know, uh, people invest a lot of money and time and effort and energy and, you know, sweat and blood and tears into these companies. And, uh, sometimes they get good results. Sometimes they don't, but, um, in this uh, other company, our special guest tonight got some amazing results, was doing very, very well. So since then, obviously she left that company. She was uh, personally sponsored by Adam and Ashley Reeker, who are here in the uh, conference room tonight. So they actually um, sponsored tonight's guest. And she has on very on her very first day, I believe, she went all in with her business. She went all in. She started taking massive action right off the bat, which is the reason why she's on tonight. She started taking massive, massive action, started driving traffic, started connecting with people, started getting on the phone with people, started getting on video conferences with people, started plugging them into the system, started taking them through the process. I'll, her, I'll let her explain the whole thing. But, you know, she basically started taking massive, massive action right from day one. Everything that we talk about all the time uh, here in our lifestyle, everything that you hear Joel talk about all the time. And that's exactly what she did. So, uh, guys, without further ado, I want to introduce you to uh, Jen. And I hope I say this correctly. Jen Weeman, who is an absolute rock star. She's been in the business now for just uh, about a month, a little bit less than a month. And she's already had several, several, several all-in sales and she's already started to grow a very, very massive team. And it's just duplication after duplication after duplication. She's doing it right. So, Jen, why don't you come on up, hit the old talk now button, and uh, come on up and say hey and introduce yourself to uh, the world of Now Lifestyle here. There she is. There you are. <laughs> How are you tonight? I'm excellent. Yourself? Good to see you. Doing good. Thank you. Thank you. Um, thank you for the nice introduction there. That was yeah, no fun. problem. So um, we get right now as we get going and we'll get up over 100 people. So and obviously this replay is going to be viewed thousands of times. So, um, you know, tell everybody that's watching now just a, a little bit about yourself and and um, I guess, you know, how you got starting, how you got your start in, you know, building a business online. Absolutely. So um, I am a stay-at-home mom. I have two kiddos and one on the way. Um, and that's kind of what I've aspired to be for a long time. I, I ran multiple businesses, um, photography being one for six years. And I thought, you know, that I was the, I was 
doing living the dream by you know being able to have my business at home but honestly i was working so much i my kids barely saw me um and so i knew i needed to make a change and i knew i needed to find something that i could do online um so as you have said i uh moved to through a few different adventures um some different offline mlms and some different um just different opportunities. And then I came across DA. Um, actually, a couple that I have sponsored, sponsored me in DA. And um, it was an unfortunate event that had happened. But like you said, you know, sometimes those things lead to even more fortunate opportunities. So um, that's Hence why we're talking that. today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So then um, I kind of watched Ashley and Adam for a little while um, and just Did you stalk them like they stalked me? <laughs> um, I actually needed a little bit of time to decide what I really wanted to do and just kind of was waiting for a prime opportunity because I wasn't going to jump into something that wasn't a good fit um, right away. So yeah, awesome. once I once I talked to them, it was game over. I think I told Ashley, I said, I don't even care what the opportunity is because I like you guys so much. <laughs> so, but then it worked out that the opportunity was pretty awesome. So, yeah. Yeah, it is a pretty awesome opportunity for sure. <laughs> so, I, I, you said something pretty important that I think a lot of people um, that aspire to. You know, you were in a position where you just weren't satisfied with what was going on with your kids, with your, obviously your soon to be kids. Um, and you needed to change. You needed to make that change. You needed to, you know, kind of create really, I'm guessing realistically the lifestyle that you want and really you and your family deserve. So a lot of people here, I mean, obviously you're a stay at home mom, you get to be home with your kids every day. A lot of people are expiring right now to be where you are, which is great. So I guess take people through or give people a little bit of confidence right now. You know what? Cause a lot of people with building an online business, they have a fear that they're going to push a button and they're going to break something. They're going to screw something up. They're going to, um, it's not going to work right. They're not going to get the results so they can do what you're doing right now, which is, um, you know, staying home and being with your kids every day and, and making money right from home. So what would you say from a confidence standpoint or, um, how do you coach people really to give them the confidence that they can do this? Well, um, honestly, it's when I stepped into it with Adam and Ashley, I said, it has to be simple. It has to be something that is not overcomplicated and it has to be something that I can take at my own pace. And they said, you got it, Jen, you got it. And um, Ashley said, we will walk with you if you want to walk. We'll run with you if you want to run. And Adam is going to jump all in because I know how she rolls. But um, the cool thing about it is when I jumped in and I started it, I realized that there is not a more simplified platform out there. Anybody who has had zero experience all the way to somebody who's had lots of online experience can do well in this. The tools are all laid out in front of you and you have a coach. You have somebody to help you through the process to teach you how to use the tools that are laid out in front of you. So I think the most important thing is that it truly is simple if you keep it that way. And that's... I think that's just it right there. I mean, you, you hit the nail on the head. It's simple if you keep it that way, because obviously in, in today's day and age and today's society, a lot of people have a microwave mentality. They want that, that instant gratification. But I think in that, sometimes people will take something very simple and overcomplicate the crap out of it way more than it needs to be. Mm -hmm. um, so obviously we have, take, take us a little bit through your process because it is just a few steps. So, um, you know, when you, and we do have a couple of questions coming in right now, guys, just do us a favor, uh, save all the questions till the very end. We'll be more than happy to answer uh, any questions that you guys have, either myself or Jen or both. We can um, make sure you guys get all the information you guys need tonight to make an informed decision. Um, if you guys, you know, still haven't jumped on with our lifestyle, you're crazy by the way, if you haven't, just saying. But, um, so it's a simple process, so 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 process
um, a, a brand new person. Because um, obviously your, your team's growing very, very quickly. And you're, I know that you're talking to and you're, you're coaching people every single day. Um, take, take us through the process that you would uh, take a brand new person through. How do you simplify you know, that anxiety, that stress level for them? Yeah. Um, first, I, when somebody lands in my holding tank, um, that's somebody that I know has jumped in. They've seen my emails or they've reached out a different way. I know that they are ready to get started with the business. And I, I am so excited to work with people who are ready to start. Um, it, it's exciting to have people who jump into your emails, but it's even more exciting when somebody comes in and they're ready and you know that they are where you were two weeks ago. <laughs> and so what I do is I connect with them and um, I will send them a text. I will send them an email. Basically what Ashley and Adam taught me to do, I, I am doing and I'm teaching others to do. So um, I connect so with them. So you're not reinventing any wheels there. No. Nope, There's no nope, magic nope. I don't have time for that. <laughs> There's no hidden Shoji screen with all these cool answers behind it. You're just doing what the leaders are doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. And cool. I, the cool thing about it is leaders create leaders. So um, I know if I just follow what's working, um, it's just going to be keeping it simple. So just connect with them. I um, In my broadcast emails, I send them my Facebook, my Instagram. Um, I hook them up with our Skype Skype group. You know, we have the emails going out. Um, I just make sure to have broadcast emails. Um, so they get to know me. They have the opportunity to get to know me on a deeper level. Um, and then I don't, I try not to flood them with information. I just start out in the beginning and I say, Watch the first video. Joel set up the video on these videos this way on purpose. And if we try to take them outside of this, then you're undoing what Joel's already done and what he's worked so hard to create. Um, so I just, I knew that I needed to keep it simple and I want to keep it simple for people coming on. So I just, I say follow the steps, connect back with me, ask questions, and be patient and consistent. And, you know, it's really, really cool when I reach out to people, but it's even cooler when they reach back out to me and they say, hey, I have already set up my LCS. I have looked into, you know, the traffic and the different options for that. Um, I have some questions on that and I'm like, yes, I know you're ready to go and I'm ready to invest time and energy and effort into you and your business. Yeah, it's always nice when the people are headed your way, you know, telling you what they've done. I mean, it just, it makes it that much easier. But I mean, it's it's funny because, um, you know, obviously last week we interviewed Amanda and Cole Custer who uh, dropped a ton of value. They kept it really simple. They were down to earth. I'm hearing, you know, honestly, a lot of, and this is a good thing, I'm hearing a lot of similarities uh, in what you're doing with what Amanda and Cole are doing. And also, uh, you know, uh, two weeks ago, what, Adam and Ashley are doing. I mean, you guys are all really keeping it super simple. You're following the steps, you're plugging people in, you're getting them to follow the steps as well. So as far as action goes, I mean, obviously you're plugging people in because people are reaching out to you based on the, the type of traffic. You know, when you took massive action in, in your first couple of days, what were some things that, that you did to really get that momentum going? You know, did you reach out to people on social media? Did you buy traffic? Did you invest in guaranteed paid signups? Like what were some of your strategies to really get going quickly? I actually did it all because I wanted, I wanted to be able to say when people started coming to me, I wanted to be able to tell them real honest, you know, what I like the best, what worked the best for me. And then I also knew that consistent in those different track routes to actually know how they're working and if they're going to work for me. Um, and so then to give people the best um, options and honest um, feedback, then I knew that I had to have all of those things under my belt. So I did that right away. Plus I knew that it couldn't hurt to have traffic flowing from different areas. Um, so one thing with that though is 
that meant that I needed to be, I needed to know how this business worked right away because I was going to have people coming in asking me questions, um, which is really cool too, because I've had um, you and I've had Ashley and Adam and I've had people on our team who I obviously don't know all the questions. I've only been doing it a little over two weeks. And so I don't know all the answers, but I do know where to find those answers and I do know how to learn with people and I know how to be honest about it and say, hey, I'm not sure about that. And it's okay not to know, but I do know where to find the answer and everybody here wants to help everybody. Yeah, that's true. I, again, you know, you, you keep saying really cool, important things here, but, um, you know, you just said that you don't know everything. You know, when I first started, I, did, I didn't know everything either. I still don't know anything, even though somehow somebody out there gave me the nickname Google 2.0. But because um, obviously my knowledge has grown, you know, my knowledge has grown over the last year and change. But, um, you know, yeah, you don't know what you don't know. So, I mean, it, it's I guess that's a that's a confidence thing that you can probably extend to your new people that start that obviously they're nervous, they're, they don't want to mess anything up, but giving them the confidence that they don't have to know everything because we have the answers either with a video, with, you know, a PDF sheet or something like that. But most of the time we have videos for just about everything. So I would imagine that you probably just, anytime somebody has a question on either how to do this or how to do that, you basically just point them to a video or plug them into the Skype plug a Facebook group, have them watch a Facebook Live or something like that, right? Yep. I usually say, uh, there's a video for that. <laughs> Let me link it to you. It's like um, there's an app for that. <laughs> yeah. Um, one thing, though, that I've learned through the process is that in order to not drop anybody, because I have had a lot of people reaching out to me, my team is growing very rapidly. And um, in order not to drop anybody that really wants to get this business started, who is really looking for somebody to coach them, um, I make sure to keep uh, documentation of who I have. So somebody in my holding tank, whoever's in my holding tank, you know, there's different ways to do it, whether it be like Google Docs or spreadsheet or something like that. But I just have those people documented that way. Um, uh, and I don't place them until I've either texted or, well, texted and emailed them. So, and then I will make a note if they respond back. And then, you know, if, if we're what, where we are in the process of getting them started. Um, so that, cause that's really important to me. I don't ever want to make anybody feel like they are getting left behind or um, that they're not being heard or, you know, that maybe I don't possibly care because of something. So, um, you know, I think there might be people that get frustrated if they don't hear from their coach right away. Um, but we also have to, you know, when we give ourselves grace, we also have to give other people grace and know that you know, your coach is a real person and they they want to help you get started. And so, um, you know, keeping that documentation for me it helps me keep that organized and helps me keep it so I can um, make sure I'm connecting with people um, every single day. Awesome. 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 I mean, obviously, you're, you're doing a fantastic job of, of keeping it really simple, plugging people in, answering those questions, getting people, uh, you know, the information that they need to get going. And I think, um, you know, the proof is in the pudding. You're doing it in a very warm and sincere way, which is really just connecting with people, listening to them, giving them the simple steps to get started and, you know, being there to answer and, so, and support their questions. And obviously, with doing that, with taking massive action from day one, like you did, you got what guaranteed paid signups, you got Facebook leads and you're running solo ads. Mm -hmm. You did all three. So guys for, you know, I, I know people are commenting about, um, you know, taking notes here. I mean, that's what you call massive action. Joel says it all the time, take massive, massive, imperfect action. And here's a prime example. Jen is growing a very large team. She's making great income. And how long have you been doing this now? A little over two weeks. Two weeks. I was saying almost a month. So two weeks. Two weeks. Um, it, amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. And she's keeping it simple. And literally, it's she took massive action from day one. Guaranteed paid signups, solo ads, and Facebook leads. She did all three. And now she's growing a very, very... How many people are on your team, by the way? I looked tonight and I have almost 50, I think. 
Um, well, that's probably on your leg. What about your yeah. entire team? You know, there's over 200. It's it's pretty big. <laughs> so okay, so let me just get this straight, and I want everyone to, to hear this correctly. So in just over two weeks, you now have over 200 plus people on your team. Yeah. I don't know, guys. Do the math. Would 200 people on your team help your paycheck? I think it would. I think it would. So you're taking massive action. You're plugging people in. You're reaching out to people. When somebody joins your business because of the traffic that you're running, because you're keeping it simple, you're following the steps, you send them an email, you send them a text message, you try to get them on the phone. And then like once you actually connect with them, what, what would you say is your best way of like connecting? Is it via phone? Do you jump into uh, a video conference like we're doing now? Like how do you really um, get to know the people that are on your team? Well, I try to, um, you know how Ashley said, I want to meet you where you're at. Well, I try to meet people where they're at comfort zone. <laughs> sure. um, I, I love to get on a video conference. I love to, just because then I can share my screen, I can show them my back office, I can really walk them through, you know, how to do things so there isn't, it's efficient. Um, but if somebody isn't comfortable with that, I don't push them into it. And I say, okay, we can talk on the phone. Or um, there was somebody that has a new baby and newborns, are, it's just so impossible to be on the phone. And so just talking through through messenger, you know, just meeting them where they're at and what where their needs are um, has been the best thing. And then eventually they find the comfort level to get on a Zoom call with me or a webinar or whatever. Um, so, I, I prefer to be face-to-face -face like this, um, but I also understand where people are at and their comfort levels and um, try not to push people too far out of that. So, I mean, that, that to me sounds like a really good strategy. I mean, basically, first thing you do is connect with them and then, you know, you take the three, basically the three methods to connect, email, text, phone. And then once you have them on the phone, it's kind of, you say, all right, what's your comfort zone? How do you want to learn? And then you, obviously you work with their ability. You work with what they're comfortable with. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, so I think, I think that's great. I really think that's great because, um, you know, you're not saying, you know, you have to get on a, you know, if you want this to work, you have to get on a video, you have to shoot a video, you know, and, and you don't put people, uh, in a position where they just, you know, it puts them off. They're not gonna. They're not gonna feel like doing the business that they already feel comfortable from day one. So it sounds like you do a really awesome job of just being down to earth with people, which is which is great. And I'm sure a lot of people appreciate that too. And obviously, your team appreciates that because your team is growing very very quickly. Um, as a matter of fact, I think somebody who's on your team, Shelly Davis, who is uh, just given a shout out by Mike Potvin and Joel Terrian today because she has some of the best follow up emails and um, you know all of now lifestyle. Shelly is a rock star. Yeah, <laughs> really I mean, is. and she's on your team too. I know she, was she sp sponsored by Amanda and Cole? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I mean, obviously she's a teammate of yours and yep. that's, a, that's a reflection of you. That's a reflection of the duplication that, um, you know, you guys as rock stars are bringing. I mean, it's just, you take someone who's brand new and she jumps in, creates her follow-up series and then gets recognized by the CEO. It's kind of cool. You know, that's really cool, though, about the company, too. Like, the fact that the CEO is giving, noticing and giving props to people who are just starting. I just, I think that's awesome. And that, like, somebody who is in your position where you're a leader and you've been doing this for a long time and you, um, you don't have to, but you choose to really invest in the people that are just starting. Because that, I think that's so important to help the whole company grow. Absolutely. Absolutely. So I'm, I'm seeing by the comments too, and obviously we'll be, we'll be sure to answer some of these comments. Um, uh, some of you guys' questions at, at the end for sure, but um, there's a lot of people here that, that haven't gotten started yet. I can see that coming from the comments. There's a lot of people that haven't started yet uh, with Now Lifestyle because either, um, you know, they're not sure, they don't know if they can do it, it's a confidence thing, whatever it is. What would be your best advice to people that are sitting on the fence, that are thinking about it, that want to get started, but they just feel like they might not be ready, they might not have the confidence? What would be your best advice to them? You really try. If I would have never gave, given it, a time of day, I wouldn't be where I am now. If I would have continued to say, eh, I'll start tomorrow, or I'll start when I'm ready, or I'll start when I think I'll be good at it. You're not going to be good at something until you start it and until you just continue in doing it. Um, so 
you know, like I said, give yourself grace, give yourself grace enough to start and just step outside. You know, I don't push people out of their comfort zone, um, but I kind of expect that people are going to step out of their comfort zone when they're ready. And growth happens outside of your comfort zone. Another thing is, you know, hard up, hard things happen, but you can't let that make you quit. Because if if I would have quit after a hard thing happened, I wouldn't be here right now. And let me tell you how much I thank Adam and Ashley for sharing this opportunity with me because it has been something that has helped my family and it's helped me. It's helped me grow. I've connected with people from all over and it's just, it's just a really cool opportunity. And if you're sitting on the fence, um, it's not doing you any good to stay there. So, you know, it's, it's a, it's a $1 trial. It's a $1 trial. Like, and you actually get to start running. Oh, I know. <laughs> but you actually get to start running the business. You're not just jumping in a $1 trial and they're holding, just like keeping back stuff from you until you start paying. No, you can actually start your LCS and running traffic on a $1 trial. You can start building your team on a $1 trial. Like, that's huge. Yep. So, a couple of quick things. Um, number one, you, you dropped a huge bomb about 45 seconds ago. And I don't know if anybody caught it, but I'm gonna repeat it. So if you have a pen and you have some paper handy, write this down. Jen said that growth happens outside of your comfort zone. Growth happens outside of your comfort zone. So if you guys, if you want to live that type of lifestyle, like Jen's living right now, where she gets to stay at home, she gets to be with her kids every single day, she gets to you know, help people win every day, if you want those results, you got to step outside of your comfort zone a little bit. So if you're a little bit nervous with starting now lifestyle, if you're a little bit nervous with starting a business online, then you, you got to, you just got to take that step and know that we as a team, we as leaders, we as now lifestyle are here to support you uh, 110%. Um, the other cool thing that I wanted to mention is obviously, Jen, you're having such an impact of growing a fast team and just being who you are that the CEO is in the conference right now commenting uh, how know. awesome this is. So <laughs> that's kind of cool. That is Just crazy. saying, congratulations. <laughs> that's, that's pretty cool because Joel's actually in here uh, dropping smiley faces and saying how awesome and how great a value <laughs> that you're dropping. So congrats to uh, have, making an impression for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Well, he's awesome for taking the time to be here. Like I said, I, I just think it's really impressive that, you know, he supports his entire team. Yeah, he does. He really awesome. does. And, uh, you know, you know, we have amazing leaders that, um, you know, help provide a lot of value. We have a CEO that provides a ton of value and we're all here to help everybody win. And that's it. And if, and if you guys aren't winning, then we're not winning. So, uh, you know, our goal as leaders and as, as now lifestyle as a whole is to, to help people win, to help people succeed, to take the average person, you know, the, the grocery store clerk, the cashier, the person pumping gas, the landscaper, the guy that works in an office building, that's sick of working in an office building. You know, the mothers that want to be stay at home moms with their kids, like we're here to help everybody get to where they want to be. Exactly. Absolutely. So, yeah. So, um, yeah, we got people saying this is the greatest and all that stuff. So obviously you're, you're making an, an awesome, awesome impact for sure. So just to, to recap a few things real quick. I mean, you took massive action from day one. You got some guaranteed paid signups, you got some Facebook leads, you ran some solo ads, you got a lot of things moving. And then as people started to join your team, someone lands in your holding tank, which for all you newbies, that just means that somebody <coughs> else signed up, pay up a credit card, somebody pays and signs up and joins their team. Once someone joins your team, you send them an email, send them a text message, call them. And once you connect with them, you literally help them understand the three simple steps that you started when, when you got started, which is how to take massive action and how to get your business moving quickly. Is that kind of sum up what you've been doing for the last two weeks? You got it. <laughs> I'd say that's pretty simple. It sounds like a pretty simple system to me, wouldn't you say? I'd say so, yeah. <laughs> now, riddle me this too, because I'm sure before 
your 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 former company that you were in, um, you know, prior to Now Lifestyle, prior prior to the one that got shut shut down. How many different online opportunities, offline opportunities in the past, however many years have you been in? Do you think? Oh my gosh, I'm embarrassed to even like talk about it. Is it in double um, digits? Um, it's pretty high up there. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So. Fair enough to say that you have been in 10 plus different opportunities over the years? Yeah, some I've created, some I've just found, that kind of thing, yeah. All right, so obviously that also, too, just to point out, too, and I know uh, Amanda and Cole last week went through this, too, where clearly in your mind you have the passion, you have the, the vision, and you have the desire to achieve the goals that you're achieving. And that has kept you consistent. Even when your company fell out from underneath you, you found another way. You kept going. Um, and that opportunity just happened to be now lifestyle, which obviously is awesome because we're here, we're hanging out, and you're getting amazing results. So speak to just a little bit about, I mean, your why and the consistency that you've had over the years and maybe share with other people like who – you know, sometimes people don't understand their why. I mean, at, at first, your why can be about the money, you know, because money creates a lot of freedom. But when you really dig deep, I think your why keeps you going, doesn't it? Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, my why, honestly, is just I've wanted to simplify. I've wanted to be at home. I've wanted to find a way to help my husband not have to work 50 plus hours a week, but still be the one raising my children. And through that process of searching for that, I have created so much um, just unnecessary action. And so I was searching for, I can't even tell you how perfect this opportunity is for me because just simplicity just so something real, sorry real quick when you say unnecessary action you mean like opportunities that didn't pan out for you or didn't work the way that you wanted them to well and and also you know just uh, things that i just worked and worked and worked really really hard for not a lot of money and um not that i mean helping people i i want to help people that's that's huge for me but it is important for me to also be able to provide for my family. And so this platform has just been so cool because it's given me both of those things. You know, I've seen an income right away, immediately. I've been able to help so many people. I've had a platform to share my heart in helping people. And yet I haven't had to work over I think last night I had a few meetings and it was two hours. And that was the most that I've worked in a day in this entire two weeks of being here. Um, I used to think that I didn't, I was kind of lying to myself about how much I was actually working before. <laughs> when I look back, you know, it would be hours and hours of time that I'd be spending trying to connect with people who actually weren't really interested in the business or whatever I was trying to do. And this is, people who I who are already ready to start the business. So people who are action takers and coming in, I'm investing my time into. So it's it's not um, it's not like I'm just shooting out into the dark and hoping that I find somebody that wants to do this with me. This is people who are ready, people who are willing and people who want to take action now. And that's just that's really cool. <laughs> so, I mean, yeah, obviously now life's a great job of supplying guaranteed paid signups, people that have already joined the Facebook leads, which are, again, people that are interested in what we have to offer. And then again, same thing with solo ads too. Those folks are also interested in making money online. You know, realistically, we're offering and, and connecting people with what they're looking for, which is mm -hmm. great. So, with that and, and everything that you've done over the past few years, um, would you say that, you know, now lifestyle is or better or, you know, how would you describe that compared to what you've seen in the past? 
I think it helps me define my direction. It helps me um, know exactly what I need to do to be successful. Um, I know it's a vehicle that's going to get me from here to here, and it's not just going to drop out from under me. It's not going to break down on the side of the road. It's actually going to be something that will take me to where my goals are. And, um, and then, you know, it will help, like my team, will help me set new goals and then we can just go farther, you know? So absolutely, this has been all of those things that I was looking for, all of the things that I've been hoping for, all of, it's just all simplified. And I think my word last year was simplify. And the fact that I'm, you know, finding that here is it's just speaking truth into my life. So obviously from, I've only known you a short time. I've known of you for quite a while through uh, other ventures, but I, I've only known you known you for realistically, you know, two three weeks now. Obviously, you ha you have the right mindset, you have the right drive, you have the right passion, you have a heart of gold. You love helping people. In in today's day and age, it's especially especially in today's day and age with all the BS that's out there on the news. If you scroll through the Facebook feed, it's you know negative this, blah blah that, Trump this, whatever. Who cares? You have a great way of staying positive, having a, a good outlook on your own personal future with your family, but obviously, you know, the, the interest of others and helping other people win as well. This is, this is something that we don't talk about that much. Um, I know Joel's covered, it's in the back office and stuff, but having the right mindset, having the right positive energy is, you, you have to have it. Um, you know, you can't just sit back and hope and pray that everything works out. You actually have to, you know, maybe practice what you preach or put things into motion on your own time. Um, I know like in, in many, many webinars, I've talked about the, the audio books that I listen to, the books that I read, the, um, the things that I do, affirmations and stuff like that to stay positive, to focus on, um, you know, bringing good into my life. What are some things that you do to, you know, maintain your demeanor and, and stay positive and just have that winning personality that people want to be around that is so good it's so good to um acknowledge that because we a lot of times we skim over that um but self-development is huge and um you know in some of the opportunities that i've been in before you know they they did help you go through stuff like self-development um and that's that's really cool that we can come in here as coaches and we can help people, um, you know, and, and acknowledge where they are. Some people are ready to just roll and go and jump into it right away. And they don't, they've already got their self-development under control, but um, other people, you know, haven't really thought about that, haven't taken care of themselves in a long time, haven't really put that first in their mind before like just jumping into the business. And so um, that is, that's an opportunity as a coach is to share some self-development things. And, um, you know, a few things that I've done is initially when I first started um, working online, I read the book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad. And Great that book. that was huge for me. That was like, I, I actually listened to it on audiobook and I was just like, oh my gosh. <laughs> if you haven't read that book, it is it was a life changer for me. It helped me realize um, the importance of my time and um, the value of, of that. So um, that's definitely one that I would look into if you haven't already. And then also um, my faith is huge. Um, I, I am a believer and um, I will stand on that until forever. And, um, you know, really focusing on, on something, on your faith, um, that helps drive who you are and helps, you, helps ground yourself. Um, and then I know <laughs> I used to be this person that was like, okay, seriously, you're going to talk about journaling. Like, I don't want to journal. I don't want to even like think about it, but you do not know you will be amazed at how far you'll come, how far you have come if you document it. You don't know how far you've come until you write down where you came from. So, um, since I've been really looking back, like where I've gone through the hardships, I can see the highs and the lows and know when I'm in a low, you're gonna get back to a high again and it's gonna be okay. So, um, just a few things that I do, uh, exercise. I love that this business has um, fitness and 
uh, supplements, I think that's huge. I think it, it is so important to take care of yourself. It's so important for your body. It's so important for your family. It's so important for your, your mental health, your physical health, all of that. So um, I think that's huge. And I just am I'm super thankful that that's something that um, this company stands on too. Awesome. Awesome. So you do some journaling, you read good personal development books like Rich Dad, Poor Dad, and that's by Robert Kiyosaki, by the way, guys, um, which is a great book. He also has another awesome book called The Cash Flow Quadrant, if you want to stand more of the money fundamentals. Um, but yeah, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, great book. Uh, that's one of my audio books that I have. Um, so obviously you're, you're into your faith, great positive thinking, journaling, personal development. I mean, guys, these are all things that just look what the leaders are doing. You guys want great results in your business. Look what the leaders are doing. They're focused on personal development. They're taking massive action. And then they're just plugging people in and getting them to do the same thing. It's very simple. Very, very simple. Yeah, that's right. Nuggets. Nuggets. <laughs> um, so Joel beat me to the punch, but I was going to drop the, the fact that if you guys have not gotten started yet, if you have not gotten started yet, and I know a couple people earlier had posted, you know, sign me up, where do I get started, all that sort of thing. Um, all you got to do is go to the link, which Joel just dropped, by the way. Joel, the CEO of the company, is watching us now. Um, NLS1D.com. Again, that's NLS1D.com. You guys can take a dollar trial. Take a buck trial. Get on board. See if this is a fit for you. Let us plug you into the system. Let us give you the training, the tools, the knowledge. Let one of us reach out to you and say, hey, how can I help you? How can I get you taking massive action so you guys can get uh, the results that you want and deserve uh, in your lifestyles? So, um, Jen, before we take any questions, um, congrats on all your amazing success because you're a super awesome leader. You're a super awesome person, just super down to earth. And I think that's what people love and appreciate you. You've just done a, an amazing job in the last two weeks of bringing awesome people on and connecting them, plugging them in. Um, you've obviously gotten the attention of some very high up folks, which is really, really cool. Um, so any last words for anybody that's here in our conference room, uh, for anyone that watches the replay of this, uh, what any last words of encouragement or advice or what would you say to everybody here in uh, now lifestyle that they need to focus on? Uh, I'd say reach out, reach out to somebody, reach out to somebody that's here, um, somebody that you know has maybe shared an email with you. Um, people want to help; they want to help. And then also, just don't quit. If you want this, if you want something, go for it, go after it. You deserve it. I think one of the most important things you just said in there was don't quit. Don't quit. And it's, I'll, I'll say this, I'll say this. Quitting's easy. Giving up is easy. That's easy. And that's why they say if it's easy, everybody would do it. And a lot of people quit. A lot of people quit. But it's the people that have the results that everybody else wants, those people didn't quit. We're not quitting. Me and this one right here, we're not quitting. Man and Cole, who were on the webinar last week, they're not quitting. Adam and Ashley, they're not quitting. Joel's not quitting. Janet's not quitting. Rich and John aren't quitting. We're going to keep going. You should keep going too, so you guys can get the results that you deserve. So, yeah, I mean, let's, uh, let's answer some questions here um, and see if there's anybody that has a uh, – Anyone that needs some help, needs some support, and then we'll, we'll get this wrapped up. Um, Steve is saying, where does the help come from? The help comes from your sponsor. Whoever your sponsor is, you can uh, reach out to them and they can plug you in. If, if that doesn't work, then you can go to nowlifestyle.com, uh, use the support tab on the right-hand side, and they can get you some uh, whatever help that is uh, you're looking for. Um, Jason says you're doing uh, guaranteed paid signups, Facebook ads, and solo ads. Um, how much, you know, basically asking how much money are you doing per week to get those, those type of results? Um, well, I, I think it's important, especially when you're starting your company to invest in your company. Um, and that's how I'm picturing it. So, um, 
but I, I guarantee you that I haven't spent more than I made. So <laughs> it's it's a personal choice. I'm not going to ask you to spend um, more than you're comfortable with. Like I said, I don't push people out of their comfort zone. Um, but you have to set a budget. You have to decide what you're advertising, what you're um, what you're wanting to spend on those guaranteed paid signups and Facebook ads and solo ads. What you want to spend um, because that in turn is you know that mirrors what you want to make. Yep, that's true. Um, one other, get... Sorry, <laughs> I was just going to say one other thing is, you know, you look at um, paid advertising and you look at um, free advertising and there are ways to do both. But free advertising is it takes time. So I've been there. I've done that. I, I know how much time free advertising takes. And so um, that is an option, but it's not it's not at a, at a lack of cost. You know, my time is important to me and my time I spend with my kids. So um, there are ways to do that, but I look at this and I'm like, I know that GPSU, Facebook ads and solo ads, they're worth it. Awesome. Um, I'm, I'm going to be real for a second. This is that, this is that moment in the, the, the webinar where um, if you're easily offended, just exit off now. And then I got to be real. Um, Someone has been commenting often that, um, Daniel, I submitted a ticket this afternoon to cancel my membership because I don't have a positive mindset. Then what the hell are you doing on this webinar? Just leave. Like, if you don't have a positive mindset, then why are you here? Either that or create a positive mindset and take massive action. It's one of the two. But don't come in here and bitch that this isn't working for you. Either get the right mindset, develop the right mindset, just like Jen talked about, journal, read books, listen to audio books, or, or, or don't just do it or don't, but don't come in here. And you can't blame anybody else for, yeah. your, for your poor mindset, honestly. So anyway, um, <laughs> Hey, I noticed somebody said, uh, that they were in DA almost got into MOBE and, but they found now lifestyle. Well, I'm so glad that you found now lifestyle before you got into MOBE after DA. Cause that would have been a heartbreaker. <laughs> Um, Stan is asking, what are your target audiences? I, I think, I mean, you can kind of tack onto this, but I think with the, the Facebook leads, the packages, the guaranteed paid signups and the solo ads, those are already really pre done for you. So you really don't have to think about target audiences. You know, that's what I love about this, that it is simplified. Um, I do, you know, I, I know how to brand myself. I know who I am and I know what I represent like in my emails and what I represent, you know, on my Facebook and all of that. So, but I, I can relate to just about anybody. And that's how I know I can go in with this company and do well because people come in and, and they're not a stay at home mom, which is what I am. Um, but I can still relate to them in some way or another. Uh, whoever demo is is saying, I tried to get in, but after I got paid, then I couldn't leave that screen. Uh, whatever you're doing, just exit out and go to nowlifestyle.com. Use the live chat on the right-hand side. They can give you the support that you need. Um, how do you handle non-personal leads? All right, here's the thing. with If you get an email that says you have a non-personal sign-up, don't do anything with it. That, that means that you got a, somebody else in your downline sponsored someone. You do not need to reach out to that person because they belong to somebody else. So you don't want to message them too and then have them start getting uh, info overwhelmed. So just let that go. That just means that your team is growing, which is a very cool thing. So congratulations that your team is growing. That's awesome. Um, um, this is kind of a cool comment. It's taken me a long time to get to the right mindset and now I just have to punch through some walls um, still. But yeah, you got to keep pushing, man. You got to... The mindset, the positivity is something you got to work on. It's not something you can't just flip a switch. You got to work at it. Um, Joel will tell you that. Jen will tell you that. Everybody, all the other leaders will tell you that. It takes time. But as long as you're, you're here uh, and you're in it to win it, then you're in the right place. Um, confused. When will they go into the holding tank? Um, when someone actually pulls out their credit card and they become a paid member, that's when they will land in your holding tank. And then once they're in your holding tank, um, you know, like Jenna mentioned earlier, that's when you want to reach out to them and then plug them in. But you also have 36 hours while they're in your holding tank uh, to place them 
into your downline. But there's a video that explains all of the guys in the back office of your business and then downline. Uh, it's a seven minute video. Watch that video, it'll explain all that. There's a video for that. How does the non personal benefit you? Uh, I just said that. It means that your team is growing. It means that your team is growing. The more people that are on your team, the more chance you have to make money as long as you're taking action and you're personally sponsoring people too. Um, all right, I'm not sure about Mo live chat, but anyway, um, Joel is actually texting me right now. <laughs> Literally, Joel's texting me right now. <laughs> All right, cool. Um, so here's a great question from some people you might know. Um, and then we'll we'll answer this. We'll, we'll get this wrapped up. Um, what are your goals over the next 12 months? Oh, man, I was setting those the other day. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, the A team would ask me that, uh, always keeping me on my toes. Um, I definitely. So hold on a second. Do you, do you mean, just so we're clear on this, you're actually you're writing down what your goals are? Well, yeah. Okay. That, it's a simple question with a very simple answer. I just want everybody to hear <laughs> that you're actually writing down what you want for goals. Okay, cool. Go ahead. You know, before this opportunity, I had invested in a life coach. And that's another thing. That was another thing for self-development. I never really believed in that. I never thought that it would really help me. But if, if you ever get the opportunity to do so, um, invest in somebody who invests in you. Um, and, and that was something that she and I did was set some goals. And since I've gotten into this opportunity, um, I've set some really lofty goals. And of course they have to line up with my husband and my family, um, but I, I want to help support my family. And I've already reached some goals. I, I'm not taking on any more weddings. I was a wedding photographer. I'm not taking on any more weddings for this next year. So I just need to make that um, income up in this and so income is a, a part of my goals and building a team, building an amazing team who who wants to duplicate the success that we're finding. Awesome. Awesome. Well, listen, we've been on for uh, almost an hour now. Um, again, congrats on all your success. I mean, literally in the last couple of weeks, you're, you're just kicking major, major butt um, and you're growing an awesome team. You're super awesome. A uh, genuine person, a real everyday person that's getting amazing results, um, and you're helping normal everyday people like you uh, getting amazing results. So, uh, for everyone that's watching, uh, just give Jen a, a quick round of applause and an add a girl for dropping some major, major bombs. I hope you guys took notes. Um, look for her on the leaderboard because she's going to be locking in a permanent position. Um, possibly in my rear view mirror, but I don't know, maybe she'll pass me. We'll see. <laughs> Challenge we'll see. accepted. <laughs> but uh, yeah, before we wrap this up, Jen, any last words? Uh, thank you for your time and thank you for letting me share. Awesome. Appreciate that. Well, listen, guys, you guys have a fantastic evening. Have an awesome rest of your week. Uh, stay tuned tomorrow night for Richard and John. Stay tuned on Thursday for uh, Janet, both of those are at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. As always, we will see you guys on the next video, and we will definitely see you guys on the leaderboard. Have a great night, guys. Bye.